Good morning. It is 6.15, maybe just after 6.15. Come on. Just got ready a little bit. It is still dark. I'm just gonna try and get a little reading in before Makai wakes up. I set an alarm for 5.50 this morning and I woke up at like 5.47. I don't know how our bodies do that, but that's been happening to me a lot recently where I'll wake up like two or three minutes before my alarm. I feel like I have no energy right now. Gabe is still asleep. I'll show you the sunrise. So pretty. Today is my full Makaya day. I feel like I still don't have a good balance of like work life and mum life. Maybe that's because I work from home. I don't really, I don't know what it is. But I love days like this where I can set aside my work and like just spend time with her. I get like really emotional trying to figure out this balance too because I love work but I love Makaya more. <laughs> work takes up a lot of time. We have someone help with Makaya when we do need to work which just gives us the, the freedom to like podcast and you know do everything we need to do. I am gonna take her to the library today. I want to do some crafts with her. Gabe's birthday is next week, so I want her to like help me make something for him. She is just talking more, like she can probably communicate with us, understand a lot of what we're trying to say. She's so playful and so funny, like has such a great personality. Now we're like starting to be able to do like craft stuff. She loves drawing. She'll probably wake up at like between 6.45 and 7. Hopefully I can read a little bit, maybe even unpack the dishwasher if I'm going really well. The lighting in this room is really bad. I haven't shown this room yet, but this is my little reading room. So I'm in my big reading chair. Basically when I read in the morning, I just just get the Enduring Word app, which is just a commentary to follow along, like as you read the Bible. It just really helps me understand like context. I'm not very good at like reading a piece of scripture and like immediately understanding like what it means. She's still asleep. I'm gonna say I have a good 20 minutes. Mornings like these truly really make such a difference. Having some quiet time in the morning with a cup of tea. I feel a little girl, girly sick this morning. Today is day one, which just makes me want to lay here a little bit longer. Also made me definitely want to turn off my alarm and get back in bed. It's okay, it'll be a good day. I'm gonna quickly go do the dishes. Makai is starting to wake up. Gabe is still sleeping because he's like, we're just exhausted <laughs> from the past couple weeks. He also did a Spartan race, like an obstacle race thing on the weekend and like his body's just exhausted. So I might make him a coffee and like go try and wake him up. Okay, I'm gonna get quickly get dressed and ready for the day before Gabe goes to the gym. I think you guys will be as shocked as I am. This video is sponsored by Skims. I feel like a lot of you guys would know that I shop at Skims a lot and that I love their products. So thank you, Skims. What the heck? So I'm gonna show you some of the new pieces that I got from Skims. So much of my wardrobe is Skims. I can show you a couple pieces. Skims is the place that like you can get anything and you know that it will be great. I was trying to think like if someone hasn't shopped at Skims before and I was to recommend something, you really can't go wrong. Like all of the products that I have, I love. There hasn't been something that I've tried that I haven't liked. I think if you were to buy something, I would say get a sleep set 
get some PJs because these are just like, I live in these. I wear these literally every day. They will get in the wash and then I will wear them again. This is a sleep set from their soft lounge collection. They have a bunch of different collections. They have a cotton collection, which I also really like. These are two other dresses from Skims that I have. You can see they're the same color. This would be really great. I mean, you can totally lounge in this. For me, I wear this type of thing, like if I'm going out on a date. If you see me in this black dress that I, I'll usually pair this with a denim jacket and some sneakers. This is Skims. I wear this all the time. Okay, this set. This is from their soft smoothing collection. It is incredibly buttery and incredibly flattering. I just had a call with Skims the other day too, by the way. And what I said to them was the thing about Skims that I really like is that especially going through my postpartum body changes and like I stopped breastfeeding a couple months ago, my body has changed even more since then. Everything I own of Skims, I will put on my body and I look in the mirror and I'm like, gosh, I feel really good in this. Everything is just really flattering and like just makes you feel really good. I can't describe it. Soft Smoothing Collection has a lot of really great basics. They're like very elevated basics. Like these just look kind of luxury when you put them on the great quality. This whole collection is really good for like putting on and lounging at home. I was in this yesterday, just like getting some work done at home or out running errands. What's also really good about their basics is like this is a great lounging piece, but you can also dress it up, make it nice and casual with some jeans and sneakers. Anyway. Okay. This is another set from their soft lounge collection. So this is soft lounge. It is really soft ribbed material. So my dresses are also soft lounge. This is different for me. These are boxes and a little tank. So comfy hanging out in the house but this tank also is something that you can dress up okay the next thing that i have this is from their cotton range these are 95 percent cotton made from natural fibers so these are some leggings and a little tank probably my favorite well no this is definitely these pjs are my favorite of the new stuff that i got but to wear like during the day this is definitely my favorite set so this is also from the cotton collection these pants so comfy and then this is my favorite like basic top I'm going to be wearing this so much now that Nashville's getting cooler. I love this as a set. It like looks really nice and put together. This top, I'm going to get this in more colors because it just is so flattering, fits so nicely. The thing I have the most of from Skims would be their bras. Wearing one today, I literally wear their bras every single day. When I was breastfeeding, I have two of their like maternity bras, which I really liked those two. They just like have a clip up the top. But what I used the most um, were the bralettes that I already had, kind of like this. I'll put a picture of it and you can just easily like whip them to the side. I wore those every single day, still do. But they also have three pairs of underwear for $36. So I will leave a link down below. Definitely go shop Skims. If you've never shopped from Skims before, I hope this is showing you some pieces that you could get. Makara and I are headed to the library soon. So, and it's cold outside. So I feel like I need to probably wear jeans and a jacket over top. And Gabe's going to the gym. So I should stop talking. I'm good to go. Okay, Makara and I are leaving. We, I would really like to go to somewhere like Michael's before we go to the library. The library starts in 50 minutes. They're like story time. Yeah, I think we can do that. Kaya, let's go to Michael's. Do you want to go to Michael's? And we can make daddy something for his birthday. Does that sound good? Do you want to listen to music? All right, let's put on some music. We'll go see what we can find and then we'll go, we'll go do a little story time at the library. I think one of our friends is going to join us too. I don't know how this camera angle is gonna go, but we're leaving the library. That was so much fun. If you're a parent and you've never like explored a local library, definitely recommend because a little like story time is really cute. Makaya loves just like being around the other babies and it's good to like get them socializing with other little babies. It is pretty much a nap time. She also gets out a lot of energy too. So hopefully this is a good nap. We're gonna go see daddy. Bye dad. Dad, dad, can you say nan nan? And then, can you say pop pop? Pop pop. Yeah, good job. Dada. 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 <laughs> what does a lion say? Rawr, rawr. Did you know a duck goes quack? Dada. Quack quack. Do you want to have milk? Okay. Yeah, good job.
She is already asleep. I have five minutes till our call. I might just make like some avocado toast. Okay, our call's over. Had some avocado toast and Makai's probably gonna sleep for another hour. I'm gonna try to tackle some of this. Basically, our closets just got installed last week and we were waiting for these for two months. Little by little, like as I have time, I've been trying to unpack my stuff. We're just still living in a mess and I think Gabe's for the most part is done. His looks really nice and neat. Yeah, I haven't showed this yet. I keep meaning to vlog it or put it on my Instagram, but I'm super happy with how it turned out. Basically, this was a design that I had done in Ikea, like the Ikea design system, but there was a gap. So we ended up going with a custom closet designer and I showed him my Ikea design because we had kind of figured it out to like give us the most space. Like this is exactly the space that we wanted. So he, he just recreated it. I'm going to try to attack this. I also am meant to be going to Pilates this afternoon with one of my friends, but my tummy and like my cramps are just not feeling good and I'm kind of fighting with myself because I'm like I'm sure if I got through the class I would feel better and it would probably help my cramps. This is a really hard Pilates class even without cramps and without a period. I'll see I'm just like mentally fighting with myself right now. Might not look like it but this is actually better. <laughs> the fact that this box is now like empty and out of the way. <sighs> I feel like this is gonna take us like another week. Hi, Mai. Come on. I'll show you what we got from Michael's this morning. So first thing, I think I mentioned in this vlog that Makaya loves to draw and she's really good at holding pens. I got her some washable markers. She already has crayons, um, beeswax crayons, which have been really good, but she really loves holding our pens. So I thought it was probably time to upgrade to something like this. I got this piece of card just so Makai can make Gabe a card for his birthday. His birthday is in six days, but I'm just trying to get ahead. So we ended up getting this. She definitely like, doesn't know what any of this stuff is, but she was pointing to this and I was like, you know what? That's a good idea. I'm gonna get her to paint this. I'm gonna have to help her, but I thought this would be really cute as a little coaster. I think that's the craft that we're gonna try to do. Sharpie has these oil-based paints, like paint markers. We'll see if they work. I thought maybe that would work the best because I can like help her hold it because I'm not trying to get paint everywhere. Makaira is awake. Just made her lunch. So I'm going to go get her up, have some lunch and start the craft. Knock, knock. Hello. Say hi, my boy. Hi. birthday present coaster. That's really good. You want to do green? There we go. Do you like that color? Mm. Yeah. It is about four o'clock towards the end of the day. After our crafts, which turned out really cute, I hid them in her bedroom closet just for like the next couple days before I wrap them. We did like a little nature walk outside. She loves picking up like leaves and acorns. Had some more snacks. It was just a really good chill day and I feel like I got so much quality time with her. Gabe's with her now. I just had to run and pee and I was like, oh, I haven't like picked up the camera in a while. Yeah, it's four o'clock. So my Pilates class is starting now. I ended up canceling it. It is just not feeling good. It really is not feeling good. So I hate canceling stuff. Like I, I really hate canceling things. It's probably for the best for my body tonight, just to rest. I think I'm gonna go make a bone broth hot chocolate to kind of help with my pain. is putting Makai to bed. Milo, are you in dinner? This is the best spot to put dog food. It is 7.45 and I, I just went through all my emails and some of my texts and I watched our podcast for this week and our friends are still not here with dinner. 
Bruh. It's 7.45. We told our friends that we should all have dinner at 7 o'clock. Like them come over here. They offered to pick up dinner. You know who you are, Bobby and Sebastian. Wait, they're, they're 11 minutes away. Okay, they're on their way. We're literally going to oh, eat so dinner. Oh, so they're just going to be an hour late. Yeah, at 8 p.m. Which maybe that's not late for a lot of people, but for us. If uh, we eat with Makaya, we're eating at like 5.30. It is 9.30 and I'm going to get ready for bed. Our friends just left. Had a really fun night. I just have kind of like a migraine this time of the month, you know? But it was still fun. We had a really good yummy pasta for dinner. It's been a really good day. I just love having days like this with Micaiah. Time is just going so quick. And so even though I love working, really grateful to be working as well and like have the freedom to do both. Just having like a full day that I can be with her, be fully present is really, really nice. Anyway, I'm going to get ready. And head to bed. I'll see you guys in my next video.